The Chargers lost to the Chiefs 10 to 3 in Kansas City Sunday. They are now 3 and 10 on the season and officially out of the playoffs. In case any of you are still wondering. Here are three things you need to know the day after the game. If you would have told me in this offseason that a Phillip Rivers-led team would be held to just three points in three of its last four games, I would, I would probably kick you and then I would start crying and then I would call you all kinds of funny names because that is just, it ain't happening. But that is what's happened. Since the bye, the Chargers have been held to just three points in three of their last four games, twice against the Chiefs, once against the Broncos. And if you want to even take that a step further, they haven't scored what we're calling a meaningful touchdown against any AFC West opponent yet this season. They scored a few touchdowns in the fourth quarter of the Raiders game, but it was 37-6 going into that fourth quarter. So we're calling that garbage time. Now here's another depressing stat. The Chargers are worst in the NFL in rushing touchdowns. They only have two on the season. Both of those came week one. Both of those came off Danny Woodhead against the Detroit Lions. So it would be fine that they haven't scored any rushing touchdowns if they were scoring all kinds of other touchdowns, but that isn't happening. This is an offense that is in quicksand. It is stuck. However, let's give some love to the defense, shall we? Just a little bit. This is a defense that has held the Broncos and the Chiefs to just 10 points each in the last two weeks. Two good teams with two good offenses. This Chargers defense looks like it's finally beginning to find a little bit of an identity and a bit of a core. Jerry Atautu, Denzel Perryman, Jason Barrett, Manti Teo, even Jaleel Ladai starting to come together and play as one unit instead of just a bunch of individual players doing their own thing out there. They're starting to build an identity, starting to know who they are as a defense, starting to show some signs of life, what their strengths are, how to play off of one another, and that they can hopefully carry that into the next season. Does any of this even matter to you guys? Do you even care? I mean, the Chargers are playing what could be their very last game in San Diego on Sunday, their very last game at Qualcomm Stadium on Sunday when they face the Dolphins. It could be the last time we ever see them play here as the San Diego Chargers. So does any of this even matter to you guys or, or, or is it all just about that? I don't know. On that very happy and cheery note, have a great day, guys. I'm signing off. From Mighty1090.com, I'm Annie Heilbrunn.